Astronomy events May 2022, stargazers will have plenty to look for in the night sky throughout the May 2022 month, including an alignment of five planets and a total lunar eclipse. A quick update on the big time machine, which will look back in time, the NASA's James Webb Space Telescope. JWST is currently orbiting the Sun around the second Lagrange point L2 nearly 1 million miles 1.5 million kilometers from Earth. The James Webb Space Telescope continues to cool down to its operating temperature of minus 369.4 degrees Fahrenheit as it prepares to take its first scientific images of the distant universe this summer. One of the telescope's four instruments, the mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, needs some extra help from a dedicated cryocooler as it needs to get to an even colder temperature, above absolute zero, the temperature where the motion of atoms stops. If you like our videos please subscribe to our channel, Secrets of Space to get notified about space videos in future. Let's take a look at some top astronomy events happening in May 2022. Conjunction of Venus and Jupiter Venus and Jupiter will share the same right ascension, with Venus passing 0 degree 14 to the south of Jupiter. The pair will be visible in the dawn sky, rising at 3.39 IST, 1 hour and 59 minutes before the sun and reaching an altitude of 21 degrees above the eastern horizon before fading from view as dawn breaks around 5.23. Venus will be at Mag minus 4.1 and Jupiter at Mag minus 2.1, both in the constellation Pisces. Aquarid Meteor Shower 2020 to the Eta Aquarid Meteor Shower will be active from 19th April to 28th May, reducing its peak rate of meteors around 6th May. Over this period, there will be a chance of seeing eat aquarid meteors whenever the shower's radiant point in the constellation Aquarius is above the horizon, with the number of visible meteors increasing the higher the radiant point is in the sky. The shower will not be visible before around 1.56 am each night when its radiant point rises above your eastern horizon. It will then remain active until dawn breaks around 5.09 am. Lyrid Meteor Shower 2022 Lyrid Meteor Shower will be active from 3rd May to 14th May, producing its peak rate of meteors around 8th May. There will be 17 meteors per hour during this day. Over this period, there will be a chance of seeing etelirid meteors whenever the shower's radiant point in the constellation Lyra is above the horizon, with the number of visible meteors increasing the higher the radiant point is in the sky. Total Lunar Eclipse The moon will pass through the Earth's shadow between 28 UTC and 555 UTC, creating a total lunar eclipse. The eclipse will be visible any location where the moon is above the horizon at the time, including from Africa, the Americas, Europe and French Polynesia. It will not be visible from India since the moon will be beneath the horizon at the time. The total eclipse will last from 9 o'clock until 10.24. The moon will be partially eclipsed between 28 UTC and 5.55 UTC. Eclipses of the moon are easy to watch with the unaided eye. A modest pair of binoculars will give a superb view of the moon's surface, but are not required. Unlike solar eclipses, lunar eclipses are entirely safe to look at without the need to look through any kind of filter. Full Flower Moon May's full moon, known as the Flower Moon, will be a supermoon, as the lunar phase coincides with our satellite's closest approach to Earth. It also coincides with the only total lunar eclipse of the year, earning it the moniker Super Flower Blood Moon. 
So, sky watchers who miss out on the lunar eclipse can still enjoy the full moon glowing slightly bigger and brighter than normal in the night sky. Conjunction of the Moon and Saturn The Moon and Saturn will share the same right ascension, with the Moon passing 4 degree 27 to the south of Saturn. The Moon will be 22 days old. The pair will be visible in the dawn sky, rising at 12.41 am and reaching an altitude of 44 degrees above the southern horizon before fading from view as dawn breaks around 5.08. The Moon will be at Mag minus 12.1 and Saturn at Mag 0.6, both in the constellation Capricornus. Conjunction of the Moon and Mars The Moon and Mars will share the same right ascension, with the Moon passing to degree 46 to the south of Mars. The Moon will be 24 days old. At around the same time, the two objects will also make a close approach, technically called an apples. The pair will be visible in the dawn sky, rising at to 12 am, 3 hours and 11 minutes before the sun, and reaching an altitude of 36 degrees above the southeastern horizon, before fading from view as dawn breaks around 5-7 am. The moon will be at mag minus 11.3 and Mars at Mag 0.7, both in the constellation Pisces. Conjunction of the Moon and Jupiter The Moon and Jupiter will share the same right ascension, with the Moon passing 3 degree 14 to the south of Jupiter. The Moon will be 25 days old. The pair will be visible in the dawn sky, rising at to 18 am 3 hours and 5 minutes before the sun and reaching an altitude of 35 degrees above the southeastern horizon before fading from view. The moon will be at mag minus 11.2 and Jupiter at mag minus 2.2, both in the constellation Pisces. Conjunction of the Moon and Venus the Moon and Venus will share the same right ascension, with the Moon passing 0 degree 12 to the south of Venus. The Moon will be 27 days old. The pair will be visible in the dawn sky, rising at 3.26 am, 1 hour and 56 minutes before the sun and reaching an altitude of 21 degrees above the eastern horizon before fading from view as dawn breaks around 5 am. The Moon will be at Mag minus 10.1 and Venus at Mag minus 4.0, both in the constellation Pisces. New Moon, the Moon will pass close to the Sun and become lost in the its glare for a few days. The Moon's orbital motion carries it around the Earth once every four weeks and as a result its phases cycle from New Moon through first quarter full moon and last quarter, back to new moon once every 29.5 days.